Let us now study about the velocity time graph. Now a velocity time graph basically depicts the changes in velocity with respect to change in time. So what will happen is, now in this graph, again the time remains on the x-axis and the velocity instead of distance comes on the y-axis okay time again can have any units depending on how it is moving okay velocity is normally written as meter per second square although it can vary now since we are doing this let's take one case here wherein you know there is a constant velocity. Let's say the time in hours is equal to 1, 2, 3 and the velocity at these various times is let's say 100, 200, 300. So let's say the time in seconds is 1, 2, 3, 4 and the velocity in meter per second is 10, 10, 10, 10. So there's a constant velocity that you have. Now if you start plotting this, let's say this is the time range 1, 2, 3, 4. Let's say the velocity is 5, 10, 15, 20. So when the time is 1 second, the velocity is 10 seconds. So let's say the time is 1 second. How much is the velocity? Velocity is 10. So the point has to lie somewhere over here. Right? So from 10 you draw this parallel, from this you draw this parallel. At 2, again it is 10. So this is 10. Time is 2 seconds, velocity is 10, again something like this, so point 0.1 is here, point 0.2 is here, 3, 10, so 3, 10, 4, 10, 4, 10. So as you plot this, you will find that this is a line which is parallel to x axis. So in case there is a constant velocity, the velocity curve is parallel to the x-axis. 